Hello there everybody, Ambrix here with my first ever kind of Lego rat, and this is about the Lego Movie 2 Brickheads. Now, the Lego Movie 2 is a huge Lego product, of course, and the theme is huge, you know, everybody loves it. So, um, here's my problem. The Brickheads, they gave two to Walmart, two to Target, which is completely fine with me. Walmart got two, though here's what I don't like. These were limited to 5,000 each. So Walmart got two, and usually Brickheads are $10, but nope, they're 15. I'm fine with exclusivism and all, you know? Like Comic-Con, they always get exclusives, and that's fine because they also have a limited um, number of kind of guests that can come. And you know, people who come to Comic-Con and fly down there or something and pay the ticket or whatever, you know, they must really care about it, so it's completely fine, and yeah, but you know, for these uh, Leg Movie 2 ones, so many people want them so bad, so they shouldn't be limited to just 5,000. Here's the other one on Walmart. Usually Brickheads are $10, and these should not be an exception, though Lego says, or Walmart says, because they're only a 5,000 a piece, we're gonna make them $15. And don't worry, you can always buy them on eBay. Oh wait, they're each like $70 cheapest which is definitely not worth it for a briquette. But let's see if Target did any better. Well, Target got the two more space characters, Benny and Sweet Mayhem, so they're gonna appear on screen. Um, anyway, Target kept them at $10. Yay, Target. Oh wait, no, because Target said you can only purchase them if you are a red card. A red card is a credit card that Target runs. And Target has had hackers in the past, though. You know, I still love Target. It's just that I don't know if I want to keep my money with them and open up a credit card just to get these. But fine, I'll do it anyway. Oh, wait. It takes them 7 to 10 days to decide whether or not you can get the credit card. And sure enough, just like with Walmart, they were sold out in the first day. So whether or not I get the red card, it's not going to help because they're all sold out. And then there's another rumor that LEGO is going to re-release these just without the sticker. Then everyone who got these and worked hard to get these are going to be like, I paid so much for because I thought there were only 5,000 and now you're bringing them back. And then that's going to be trouble. And then, But then the people like who didn't get the 5,000 are going to be like, um, well, you know, um, I wish they re-released them. So either way, LEGO is in big trouble and I hate it. And it's similar, like, as bad as the black VIP card, which, like, you got double VIP points, but so did everyone else. The May the 4th poly bag you got for free, but they were selling them at LEGO Land for 4 bucks, which even annoyed me, who doesn't hold the black VIP card. And then, you know, the figure they were selling for 99 cents and you could buy 500 of them. But that's it for this video, and leave your thoughts in the comments. Bye.